Good morning. I am JP Cajes, mathematics major. Today, I am going to demonstrate my skill, which is patch cable making, specifically straight through patch cable. Okay, before I'm going to start, let me introduce the materials or the tools needed. First, we have the UTP cable. UTP stands for Unshielded Twisted Pair. Next, we have the RG45. Next, we have the cable tester, which we're going to use to test whether the cable is uh, functional or defective. Next, we have the wire stripper, which we're going to use to strip or to unshield the cable wire. Next, we have the crimping tool, which we are going to use for locking or to lock and to crimp the RG45. So, let me start my demonstration. So, first, you have to get the cable wire and then the next step, you have to unshield or to get the cover of the wire, the cable wire by doing it this way. And uh, remember, you have to be very careful in this part. Okay, let me do it. This, uh, this one. Okay. okay. After, remove the part of the wire. And then, upon uh, unshielding the wire, we will see four, twist, uh, four twisted pairs of wire. All you have to do is to untwist these wires inside. And then, after untwisting, you have to follow the standard in arranging the correct sequence of the wires. So the first color in line should be white orange. Okay, white orange. Next, we have orange, white orange, orange. Then, white green. Then, blue. Then, white blue. Then, green and then white brown and then the last one will be brown okay after arranging the correct sequence of the wires you have to fix it accordingly so that it will be uh, suited in the rg45 so now since i already fixed it so i have to insert this one to the rg45 okay let me do it this way and in this process, you should have, you should also be careful in this way. Okay? After inserting the wires, the small wires in the cable wire, you have to use crimping tool to lock the uh, small wires of the RG45. So let me have this way. Again, this is to lock the, as you heard this sound, means you are uh, already, uh, Locking the so I have already this one, so I already locked the RG45. So now, uh, to test whether this uh, one is effective, we have to use the uh, tester, so the cable tester. So again, this one we are going to use whether the cable wire we make is effective or I mean functional or defective. So let us uh, use our cable wire that we made earlier. Okay, insert this one, this one, and this one to the other side. So to test, we have to turn off first, turn on first the uh, cable tester. Then, as you can see, uh, the lights are in line with each other. So in that way, you can tell that this cable wire that we made is functional. So that's all about my demonstra uh, demonstration and God bless everyone. Thank you for listening.